What is up guys? Welcome on back to TK's Garage. And in today's video, you know, yesterday or maybe a day before yesterday, I don't know if it was here or if it was on the second channel, Auto Intel Daily. I'll tag it in the description if you want to go check that channel out. It's exploding right now. Um, I talked about Ford being one of the first companies changing their DEF tunes or tunes for vehicles when they come in so that they don't immediately shut down or cause a hazard uh, to people's safety because a truck goes down to 2% power or whatever the BS it is because it knows there's no DEF in the system. Well, I saw this. I saw a question. And uh, the question was in my comments that said, can I just fill it, fill the DEF with water? Eh. With a Ford, and thanks to my guy John, who did a test for me, with a Ford, which has this new tune under the EPA guidance, yep. The problem with, and I understand the, the problem that people are having with DEF if they don't fill it up, is if you only put a little bit in, these tanks do the shit. Now, there's different levels of DEF. There's good ones, there's bad ones, whatever. But when you leave a lot of space and stuff in there, it crystallizes. And it destroys the system, basically, unless you keep it full, which is stupid, but I digress. On GMs currently, because they're not doing this new EPA guidance, and on Rams, they have a sensor that I guess looks for the quality of the DEF at like between 32.5 to 35. If they don't see that it has a, you know, a certain quality level, it'll throw a check engine light and then you'll hit a certain amount of time and then the engine goes down to, you know, 0%. But... With this new tune from Ford, which Ford is doing at dealers, and you can look in the comments, you can see like, hey, I just had my F-250 done. I just had this done. They're, and I've also seen the other comments, oh, see, they're not going to get rid of DEF. They're just doing this shit. Bro, if I could put distilled water, and I'm not, I'm not recommending anybody does this. I'm just saying... Somebody hit me up with this today and said, with the Ford tune that they were able to do this, that they put distilled water in that DEF tank and have been driving it, no check engine light, and maybe this new tune is not checking for the quality of the DEF or whatever is in that tank. Is it going to crystallize or screw up if it's just water in there? I don't know. Uh... I need to ask some of my diesel mechanics that could tell me what happens when you put it in there. I don't know what happens if you put water in there. I know it's basically piss that they pour in there now with DEF, right? Um, but, mm, 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 mm. But, um, I wonder what we're going to see General Motors and Ram get on this new EPA guidance. And I'm wondering if this Ford thing with the DEF is an error in terms of measuring the quality or, you know, the sensor, like telling if it's quality DEF or whatever, or did Ford just say, F it, the EPA administrator doesn't care. <laughs> we don't care. We don't want people to have to keep coming in here for the bloop. And they just, that sensor doesn't does do anything anymore. Possible. I don't know. I'm not a diesel mechanic. But I did find this news interesting. And um, shout out to my guy for for trying that out. He is doing a video on his YouTube channel. So as soon as he sends me the link, I will drop it. I'll either update it in here or I'll put it on the posts tab here on YouTube, the community section where I, I post like random thoughts or links or whatever. You, you can find it. You just go to the top and scroll over to post and boom, there you go. Magic. Anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. 
Give the video a big thumbs up if you like what I do. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And as always, stay petty, my friends. For the longest time. Whoa. Yeah. Perkinson, Miley Perkinson, Perkinson, Miley Perkinson.